this tigress. And she's been sitting here meowing and meowing for me to come in here. I think she wants a bath. She shedded yesterday so much. She's shedding a little bit today, too. Mama's got that extra fine cat hair. I mean, really. But she... Yeah, you're shedding still. I can't believe it. I took so much hair off of you. Meow. My tigers. Yes, I got you, yes. Look at her. She loves this. She's the one that's always on my shoulder. Yeah. I'm a good girl. What a good girl. Mama Pussycat. Boy, if she ever thinks you... you she's very... Even after... Jesus, next month's going to be six years. She's going to be seven. Uh, in a couple of months. Two, right? But next month, her babies are six years old. And she... Uh, Still very protective of them. Her adult babies. Unbelievable. She attacked me four times very viciously. This loving animal. Because she thought I hurt one of her babies. And she snapped. It was when Patches was, was screaming at me. And I was just so frustrated with her because, she, I mean, she's over 100 decibels when she screams like that. She had a fever. She was delirious. But I didn't know. I didn't know what was wrong with her. I don't had to take her to the vet yet. And uh, I I just took, I had a towel just like this. And I went, plop, I, on, on the platform below her daughter on the tree. She thought I hit her daughter. She went nuts. She sleeps with me every night for six years, this animal. Literally. Every night. I wake up with her. She's curled up next to my belly or my chest, my sternum. Every morning, this cat. I can't go to sleep without her crawling in the bed with me. Every night. And and she thought I hit her daughter and she attacked me. It was unbelievable. Four times. I couldn't get her off of me. She kept jumping. She went right from my testicles. <laughs> right from my testicles. Yeah. Twice.